The Canon 80D is like a Swiss Army knife. It's good for traveling, sports photography, vlogging. A camera that, even today, is still popular. I will tell you 8 pros and 2 cons for this camera. You will understand why people appreciate it so much and if you should get one today. First, I want to thank you all for the engagement that you have shown in the previous video of this channel. Here, you will always find photo walks and videos about cameras. This one is about the 80D. I always wanted this camera, but the price was too high. Finally, I have one. Nowadays, you can find cheap used 80Ds. Let's begin. Let me tell you the 8 pros. First one, it has a comfortable grip. No finger will be hanging out while you're holding this camera. I have big hands and all my fingers are locked in. This is important. You get a feeling of comfort that makes you want to say, I can use this thing for hours. But something else happens when you place your left hand there. The bulky camera body assures you that you can rely on it. If you're like me, switching between mirrorless and DSLR cameras, you will immediately see the difference. The 80D is not fragile. It's built like a tank. On top of that, it's not massive like a 5D, nor small like a Rebel camera. It's right there in the middle. Good for all types of hands, big or small. Second benefit, the fully articulating flip screen. Nothing gives you more flexibility than a camera with the fully articulating flip screen. You can shoot from everywhere. If you want to make something look bigger or stronger, those low angles will be effortless. No need to lie down on the ground and collect dust. You just have to bend the knees and flip the screen. Also, there are no problems if you can't find a chair or a bench around. For those high angles, you just have to raise the camera above your head. And of course, this component is very useful for video shooters and vloggers. You can see yourself. And if you want to make small adjustments, you can, because the flip screen is also touch sensitive. Good focusing speed is another big pro of the Canon 80D. It has Canon's dual pixel AF, one of the best technologies out there when it comes to focusing in live view. Video shooters also love it. Why? Because it's fast and reliable. Dual pixel AF will not disappoint you. Once it locks onto the subject, it will not focus hunt, like we see with other camera brands. Normal focusing with the mirror down is also good. Canon made this thing to satisfy everybody the portrait shooter, and even the sports and wildlife shooter. When you glance down at the camera, there's a second screen that shows you your settings. Aperture, shutter speed, ISO, everything that's important is there. A great time saver. I'm sure that this LCD screen helped a lot of photographers. It's a quick way to check and adapt your settings. Every camera should have a second screen like this one. In a lot of cases, when you have to act fast, the second screen is a must-have. A savior. The well-placed buttons and dials annihilate frustrations. As I mentioned in the previous vlog, I once had the Canon M50. Good image quality, but poor ergonomics. A frustrating camera for photographers that quickly want to capture some action. The 80D has phenomenal ergonomics. Next to the top screen, you have quick intuitive access to ISO, drive, AF operation. Also, manual mode is a lot easier on this camera. You have a dedicated dial for shutter speed and aperture settings. And the other buttons are, again, nicely placed, making it one of the best cameras when it comes to handling. Another important thing is good connectivity. The 80D has it. Everything that you want is here, on the left side of the camera. HDMI port, USB port, shutter trigger, headphone port, and microphone port. The 80D also has wireless connection. With the app, you can transfer images and control the camera. If this wasn't enough, let me tell you that you won't be stressed out if it starts raining. The camera has weather sealing. Wildlife photographers shooting in harsh conditions really need this. The true dedicated photographers that don't want to go home if the weather is bad can rely on the 80D. But if you want protection, you will also need a weather-sealed lens. Luckily, with this camera, you have a large lens variety. Owning a Canon crop sensor DSLR means that you have access to more than 300 compatible lenses. You know what this means, right? It means that you can find plenty good options at a low price. 
as we know, oftentimes the lens is as important as the camera itself. It's good to have more than 300 options to choose from. Before I tell you the cons, let me point out something that we all want and, again, the 80D has it. Good image quality in both photos and videos. I took this camera out in the park to photograph some birds. My 80D has a shutter count of 60,000 shots. I was afraid of finding dead pixels or poor image quality. But no, this durable camera shows the great image quality that I was expecting. Videos also look good. This test was the confirmation I needed. It's clear now, the 80D is great for photographers and videographers. And now, the cons. This camera doesn't record in 4K. It only captures videos in Full HD. Luckily, nowadays, video editing softwares are smart. We can use a function like Superscale from DaVinci Resolve. For example, this video was shot in Full HD and was upscaled to 4K. If you're not doing some high-end productions, you can always upscale. Second con, no in-camera image stabilization, not even digital stabilization, so we must rely on the lenses IS, if it has it. I can go on and on with the cons for this camera. It doesn't have dual card slot, it doesn't have C-Log, but as many cons as I can find, these are not things that we cannot live without. For sure, the 80D that was released in 2016 has more pros than cons. In conclusion, is this camera still worth getting today in the mirrorless era? Yes, I believe so. Even now, this still is a great camera. If portability is what you need, go for a mirrorless camera. But if you want something that is rugged, good for photos and videos, find a used 80D. You'll enjoy it. I'm curious, what is your opinion about this camera? Write in the comment section. If you enjoyed this video, consider subscribing and see you on the next one.